U.S. is all about March Madness. The NCAA insanity. It's on and it's cracking and there's nothing you can do about it. The games, the noise, the nerds who are calculating the percentage of every missed jump shot. Piers, the U.K. goes crazy over soccer. But this time of year, nothing comes close to b-ball in the States. And with the tournament comes the brackets, the predictions. Bracketology, it's called. And everyone has their picks from that sheet of paper. The weird guy who sweats in your office, the grandmas at the book club, even folks who think Orange Men is the latest self-tanning product. They're in on it, too. President Obama is also feeling bracket fever. And maybe something more. Eleven of his sweet 16 teams are from swing states. And his final four choices, North Carolina, Kentucky, Ohio State, and Missouri, are key battleground contests, too. Obama thinks Carolina will win it all. But when you're the president and playing brackets in politics, the game, my friend, ends in November. Piers Morgan will be back Monday interviewing Rick Santorum's secret weapon, his wife, Karen. He also has Massachusetts Senator Scott Brown. That's all for us tonight. I thank Piers for letting me sit in. AC 360 starts right now.